Hello guys and welcome back to Amnesia The Dark Descent my friends. This is part 4 to the playthrough and it's good to be playing this game. Let's see, I'm having a lot of fun with the previous parts and I think it's very um, tricky with some of the puzzles and stuff and trying to figure out where I've got to go and stuff. But, Asita's, I just want to get back on with this game. I want to try and make more progression on it. And I'm just hoping that you guys are all enjoying it. And if you do want me to play the other Amnesia games at some point in the near future here on the channel, then let me know down below in the comment section, okay? If you have any tips or tricks for me, or anything I should know when it comes to Amnesia, whether it's for the backstory or things to help me when it comes to um, playing the game, let me know as well, guys, because your tips and suggestions and everything can help me to get better at these sorts of things. Right. I guess I'm going this way. Let's go down this ladder. It's mad to think, though, that games like this made YouTubers like YouTubers like PewDiePie and everything famous. You know what I mean? Because these are like really iconic horror games. Alright. Some tinder boxes there, which is good. Oh, no, 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 no. Try not leak any iron. If you look at the enemies for too long, then they eventually do spot you. And obviously, we don't want no enemies spotting me, you know what I mean? Screw that, boys. Right, I need to figure out where the hell I need to go right now, because I'm kind of confused. Uh, I used to be splashing the water. Okay. There's a ladder there as well. <laughs> I could have done with that. Time to get out the sewers. Right, the coast is clear. So I'm going to go for this door, see where this door leads to. Open up, please. Right, looks like we got another puzzle. I'm going to have to try and guess these sorts of things because. Some puzzles in this game are proper tricky to do. Has that done it? Is that, have I done it right? I don't even know right now. I don't even know what that does. Uh, right, I'm going to go back this way, even though that creature thing was lurking around somewhere in this area. Let me go this way and see if that thing is gone. What the hell's down here? Ah, tinderbox. Thank you very much. Got a pipe here. Pipe seems to be loose. Do we need to break it or something? Ah. Okay, so we got the pipe. I don't know what the pipe's for, but... Hopefully we can find out, guys. So yeah, if you're enjoying all the Amnesia videos here on the channel, guys, let me know down below in the comment section. And if you're enjoying these long playthroughs, and long parts on games, then let me know. What's happening? What are you doing? Let me go! Please, I'm safe. Nobody ever returned. Okay. Whoa. 
All right, all right, all right. Chill, chill, chill. Can we, like, put something in there? Um, the pipe? Spinning wheel is spinning too fast to be jammed. Okay. So, I'm guessing we need to do something with them um, switch things, them levers, um, to slow the slow that down so then we can use the pipe in order to jam it. That's what I'm, I'm assuming I need to do. Or we can use the pipe as a weapon to beat up whatever that creature thing is and then it won't be bothering me anymore. Which is always a good suggestion. Right. I think I've done it. I think. I'm gone, boys. See you in a bit. I am gone. I'm hiding. Please don't come in. Uh. Uh, that guy saw me as well. He knows I'm here. Take a little peek. Is he gone? Hello. Hello. I think he's gone. I think it's safe to come out now, boys. Oh, man. I'm hoping that's the last of him, at least for a while anyway. I'm hoping so. Right, that's slowing proper down now, so... Can we do something about this? Can we jam this? We can as well. Right. Okay, so we crouch underneath all this. Um Guess we just have to proceed onwards and see where this leads to. Uh oh. That does not sound good. Hello? Is anyone here? Daniel, turn around this instant. You are carrying the shadow with you. Well, can the shadow leave me alone? I'd, I'd really appreciate it, you know what I mean? God damn. Okay, so what the hell do I need to do? Am I going the right way or something? Okay. Ew. That just looks disgusting. <laughs> oh man, that's that is mangy. Ew. Lend a hand or an arm or even some legs and a body. Yeah, have a have another arm. Arm, you glad I didn't do that again? No pun intended. All right. Yep. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. 
Oh, it's coming, it's coming. Uh... Oh, my days. Nope, I need to hide. Please don't come back here. Please. Don't be a douchebag. Has he gone? I don't know if should risk it. Just in case he's there. Please be gone. Yeah, he's gone. He's gone. Woo! Right. Back to making progress. Now I need to discover where the hell I need to go right now because I'm kind of confused. Unless, of course, he's created me a way. Has he made a way for me? Oh. Hang on. Uh, no, we came from this way. So he's made me a, oh, he's made me a passageway. Nice. How very kind of him. Right. Okay. I'm just gonna chill and hide. That literally sounds like Chewbacca. I'm not gonna lie. This creature things like Chewbacca on drugs, like it's just no other way to describe it. Yo, Chewie, is that you? I don't want to die today, Chewie. Okay, I need that. Okay, okay. Is he coming? Oh, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. Ah! Get going, get going, quick, 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 quick. Oh, no, please don't spot me, come on. I can't look at him. It's hard not to loop though because... No, he'll see me if I keep looking at him. Right, it's gone. I'm making a break for it. Screw this boys, I'm getting out of here. I ain't looking back. I am gone boys, officially. Oh, it's behind me. No, no, seen a bit. Gone, 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 gone. Go, 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 go. Get going now. Ah! Please don't say that thing knows how to climb ladders. I will break them on purpose. Once I get to the top of it, obviously. No, oh, man. I didn't think that thing was going to start chasing me, though. But yeah, I hope you're enjoying the video so far, guys. If you are, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I would really, really appreciate it. Turn on the post notification icon. Notify you when I upload any new content in the nearby future. And if you want to see more in Amnesia, or you want me to play the other Amnesia games once we've eventually beaten this one, then uh, let me know down below in the comment section, okay? I'll give them a go at some point, if, if of course that's what you want to see. Whew. Right. We're out the sewers, which is good. Seems like we're back in some like dungeon, dark underground sort of area, though. Do a little bit of exploring. 
Okay, is anything in here? I got a tinder box though. Good old tinder box. Thank you very much. Um, I'm just trying to think. Where do I need to go? I hate the fact that everywhere is so dark as well because you have to rely on tinder boxes and your lantern constantly in this game. Can't I just be in like just just once, be in somewhere where it's really nice and light, and there's no creepy monsters lurking around? Somewhere warm, somewhere sunny, and just away from this hellhole. That would be nice, you know what I mean? Could do with finding some more tinder boxes, to be honest. Is there any more looking around? Oh, that's there is. Give me them tinder box. Okay, can you chains rustling? Rattling? I'm hoping it's not that creature. I'm hoping you didn't get up that ladder. Or we'll found a shortcut around to me. Agrippa, I need you to stay awake. Can you feel the syringe? No. I can't feel anything, Alexander. Yes. Soon, I won't even be able to move, will I? Your life is safe. I don't doubt that. But will it be worth living? This is this game's insane. Who the hell is that? Yo, bro. Are you okay? Help me. How do I help you? Uh, okay. Wait a minute, you're not gonna hurt me, are you? Thank you. You have my gratitude. My name is Agrippa. Who might you be? Daniel? Like the prophet thrown into the lion's den? <laughs> Tell me. Are you among the lions, Daniel? You want to stop Alexander? Oh my, so Babylon shall call you, sir. <laughs> you hurry too much. Alexander is toothless without an all. He has one. That's, that's not very promising at all. The sector is basically a benefit, but I guess the why hope. It could be breached by a mass, but Alexander broke his, I mean, my own, a long time ago. Really? Well, if you tell the truth, by all means, seek out the pieces of the broken orb and mend away. I believe he uses them for torture now. They practically leave madness, which is quite useful, I understand. There should be six of them. Look around the choir and the transept. You should be able to find them there. Okay, so go find pieces of a broken orb. I hate to bother you personally, but if you're really going after Alexander, would you consider taking me with you? I know it sounds ridiculous. I mean, look at him. But if you find anything concerning a man named Johann Heim, would you please bring it to me? I believe he was working on a way to help him. A recipe for some sort of potion. A tonic to free me from this husk of mine. Okay. I'll see what I can do, okay? Can't promise anything, but I'll see what I can do. I'm Heinrich Cornelius Agrippi. I was once quite important to you. Baron Alexander has sustained my soul in a dead husk for years. Who knows? Right, so we need to find some broken pieces of orbs. The six pieces we need to find and something that relates to some guy that can help that guy that's chained up, so. This is going to be fun. I don't know what these orbs look like, and I don't know what this thing is that he wants me to find from this guy to bring you back to help him with it when it comes to a potion, but we can hopefully try our best, okay? That's all I can do, I can try my best. It shouldn't be too difficult, hopefully, anyway. 
Right. <clears throat> Be a lot more easy if there isn't no creepy monsters lurking around in the area as well. And me and my big mouth, I just said that. I can hear the guy. Why did I have to jinx it? <laughs> I'm a freaking idiot. I should have said there shouldn't be no monsters. You know what I mean? Like we'd not even said nothing at all. It would have been easier, but still. Okay, if they want to be creepy monsters, then fair dues. But just, I just don't want them attacking me. Eh. Uh... Just a little further. It's like Morpheus descending into the underworld. Are you hiding something? What do you mean? Never mind. Your intuition is remarkable. I'm not sure I'm following. It doesn't matter. It's just a myth after all. Well, it's just a myth. Hey, how this game speaks in riddles, so it's like you can't always understand what's being said. Right. Me go through here. Okay, definitely not then. Um, just trying to think, boys. If I was orbs, pieces of or of an orb, like six pieces of an orb, where where would I be? You know what I mean? He's mentioned the locations, but obviously. I need to try and figure out where them locations are, you know what I mean? Wrath of August, 1839. Banishment ritual is taking longer than expected, and we have to do what is needed. I spend my time helping out the prisoners. Being around these degenerates makes me ill. None of them even tries to face their punishment with any kind of mm. dignity. They taunt me with their lies of innocence and their cowardly pleas of mercy. What can make a man fall so far from the grace of a civilized existence? They are all wicked men, and I remind myself of it constantly. Still, I am thankful for God sending these monsters our way, as they will serve as the instruments of my salvation. I try to study the different tools in the torture chamber and learn how to use them effectively. Last time was messy, and the effect suffered from my inexperience. When the next warding is to be performed, I shall be ready. Okay. Interesting. Uh... Picked up a bucket of tar. I don't know what the tar is going to be used for, but it's going to be used for something. Okay, on top of there, we've got a tinder box. Pardon me. Um, it won't budge. Okay. So we've got a problem now. Uh, so we can't open that. Got ourselves another tinder box. Uh, I don't know what the hell I need to do right now. I'm a bit confused. I generally don't know what to do. We'll have to try this way. See where, see where, what we can find in this area. Hopefully, it can give me some some form of indication on what sort of thing I need to be looking for because I'm kind of, I'm kind of stuck right now. Now, obviously, if you do want to read the notes, like I mentioned in previous parts, just pause the video and you can read through them at any point, guys. I will leave them on the screen long enough so you can obviously pause them. Um, but for me, I'll probably just skim read them and read them off camera or something, just so they can have a, a bit of knowledge of things. 
It's only the main little notes and stuff, like the memo sort of things I need to keep an eye on mainly. But the backstory sort of stuff then, I can learn that as we're going along. <laughs> it's mad. Okay, got some symbols there. Well, that's meant to represent. Some stones here that we can't interact with. That's what this door leads to. Ah, I'm mad. Okay, so we can't go that way. Oh, nice. Got some oil. So there's nothing else in this area that we can interact with. Seems like a dead end. Um, I do not know what the hell I need to do right now. How do I get to the? Uh, how do I get these orb things? Use right now. Uh, there's got to be something that we can do, surely. Can we jump over this? Hang on. Uh, shattered orb. All the last ones. Could the first or found like this. Research. Six parts. So we need to find six parts, okay? Six parts of this all. And they're lurking around in different areas, so. How to get these all parts, I have not got a clue, but hopefully we can figure it out. Also, when it comes to the Amnesia videos as well, I want to try and make them long playthroughs as well, so. I'm going to keep trying my best to try and beat this game because I really want to beat it. Does not sound good. The monster energy drink flowing through my brains, through my body right now, pumping my brain with caffeine. <laughs> Absolutely need it today, literally, because I've had lack of sleep today, guys. And the seat is, I've got a couple of hours before I need to go to work, so it's one of them things where I've got a few hours to burn, so obviously I wanted to play some amnesia. Prisoners who are under treatment. The people you send for will end up here. Remember that the confinement itself works as a preamble to the torture, and you should pace yourself. Picked up some meat. Don't anyone before they are ready. Understood. Sounds from the torture chambers are shuttled in through those pipes in the ceiling. Manage your victims well, and let one prisoner's pain instill terror in his cellmate. Okay. That sounds really, really gruesome. Not gonna lie, guys. Obfuscating the truth in the dim haze. They may sweep the traces from my memory, but my body remembers. It is cuts speak volumes, even though my mind remains silent. They will be back. Oh, they will be back. Right. Oh, the hell? 
like an apple or something, multi apple. What the hell is that? Yo, that's weird. Alright, same thing inside these. Got a tinder box here. Very nice. Um, I'm just trying to think what else I can do, guys. I've got no clue. I, I don't know what to do right now. Something else. Alexander is quite impressive in many ways, but he has grown impatient. I'm guessing one of these cells might have something at least, you know what I mean? That can help me to try and see what I need to do next. Gotta have something, because I'm really stuck right now. Because wherever we went before, it seems like it was a dead end. There's nothing there. And then you got here, which it seems like uh, we're not finding anything. You got two locked doors, which I don't get why they're locked, because they could be possibilities, but I don't know if I can get through them or not. Um, I really, really don't know what to do. But we are going to check everywhere. We're literally going to look everywhere I possibly can, guys. And we are going to eventually figure out what we need to do. Because when it comes to games, I don't give up. You know what I mean? I, I keep at it until I until I figure out exactly what I need to do. And this is one of them situations where I'm just going to keep trying. There's going to be something that I can do that will help me. Because I've always learned in video games that doing one thing triggers another thing. And helps towards the next step. So I can figure out what the first step is. And I can figure out the rest of it. Hmm. Just have to proper use my brain for this one, though. Proper fries my brain. <laughs> uh, right. There's got to be something in this area. There's just got to be something. Okay, it won't budge. Uh, maybe. What about the area where I came from? When we went up that ladder? There was, um, there was a couple of doors there. Maybe I could try them. Um, other than that, I need to just check if there's any doors anywhere. Hidden doors or something. Or switches or something that are in certain parts of the areas or anything. Because I'm assuming there might be a switch or something that triggers a room or triggers something. And I can collect my first orb from something. But I just need to try and figure out what that something is. But it's beating away at me because I feel like it's something that's in front of me, but I do not know what it is. Like, I feel like it's like in the most obvious place, and I just haven't looped to something. Dad, good to see. I am as my pupil, my pupil. Yes, I do take pride in that. Is it so wrong? Right, I'll come back down to you in a moment, old man. I'm just, uh, I'm just trying to figure out what the hell I need to do right now. Let's go back to the top of the staircase. At least I know there's no monsters up here, which is good. <sighs> right. this one. Okay, this one won't budge. Uh, okay. 
was a bit of a dead end. Uh, slab of fresh meat. I don't know what to do right now. It's proper eating away at me at the moment. I just don't know what to do. Some meat or something? Or some food? Do you know meat rises? Well, I suppose it doesn't matter. It is an old fable, building temples out of caverns. The dark cause being the universe. Pulled with a stinky tire. Humans watching the sky slowly tire. But the followers do have one thing to It's got these doors, can't be opened from here. So, can they be opened from somewhere else? Is that what it's hinting at? I don't know. I don't know what's there. Maybe one of these prison cells might have an answer. Maybe one of them has like a, a key or something, or a switch in it or something. It could be, you know what I mean? It is a possibility, but you never know. Um, I generally don't know what to do right now. I'm just stay confused, guys. Hang on. Tinderbox. I'll take that. Okay, can't lie that one. Right. Um. I really, really don't know what to do. <laughs> I've just got no clue. I'm pretty much out of ideas at the moment. Um, it's pickling my brain. Oh, man. It's like being at school. I have to use my brain so much. For you guys out there that have beaten this game before, like, what am I doing wrong? Like, it's got to be something I'm doing wrong. It's got to be something I can interact with. Anything. I just feel like there's something here. There's got to be something. If there isn't, then I don't know what to do. One of these doors could have an answer, at least something. A clue maybe, or a summit. Some of that can help me, it's gotta be. Got this podium. The smooth, okay. Can we put the meat on it? No. Put the top, Oh. Okay. Okay. So we're making progress somehow. The tar goes on this pedestal. I'm assuming, I could be wrong, that we need to put something on top of that tar. So either I'm guessing either the ore part or it's going to be something else. Um, just 
double check these rooms again, just to be on the safe side. Just in case there is something. You know what I mean? We're making progress now. So that tar is used for something. At least. You know what I mean? Uh, this is pretty mad right now. I just don't know what to do. I'm just... There's got to be a way to get inside this room. Have you got anything that's lurking around that we could possibly use to break the lock? To open the door or something? On the plus side, at least we haven't got no creepy monster chasing after us, which is always a good thing. You know what I mean? So, it's always a good thing, because it means I can actually explore, but kind of a bad thing, because I just don't know what to do right now, because I'm, I'm literally out of ideas. A secret book that opens up the bookshelf or something? A statue here? Do anything? <sighs> okay, they don't do anything. That sucks. Um, what about this? Will this do anything if I put this on here? No? Is there like a third one somewhere or something? How did I die? You have to carry on. How did I die? That is just... Oh, I don't know. That, that was weird. I didn't even fall to my death. Literally, I just... Jumped and crouched. And I'm dead. Somehow. Unless that's supposed to happen, I don't know. We need to do. Do you need to put that on there? Got to do something with this table. Especially when it's got blood on it. What about that? Literally out of ideas right now. I do not know what to do. Oh, it's bugs on my screen and everything. In the game, obviously, not in real life. Man, that's just horrible. See if we can find anything back here. Oh. 
literally out of ideas, guys. It's got to be something. I just need a proper look. I'm going to check around on, like, walls and ceilings and stuff to see if there's anything like a, a switch on the wall or something or a summit. You know what I mean? There's going to be something. Okay, so that pedestal is for an orb. A heavy door is blocking the path. Okay, that must be these doors up here. Seeks a note that's written by that guy. Okay. So there's a note that's from that guy that we need to give to this old man. So we need to find a note. Okay. These are the doors that need to be opened. Consume themselves or break, then lose by an uninitiated. I was lucky. So all I found spared my life and returned to where I found it. I know because Alexander took it and brought it to Brighton. So these doors need to be opened from somewhere. There's gotta be something that opens these doors. A switch or something? It's gotta be summit. I was a brave man and dared to proceed where I did not. He unearthed a number of cabin Um. Hmm. I don't know, guys. Oh. Why is this game so tricky? <laughs> Why can't I do this? I should be able to do it. I just... For some reason, I just can't. There's something I'm missing, surely. it has got to be something. I feel like it's in plain sight. I feel like it's a switch or something on the wall or something. The summit. The only progression that we've made so far is finding the, the, the tub of, like, that tar stuff that goes on the pedestal. We know now the pedestal in that room is for the orb. So whenever I find these pieces, I need to take it to that pedestal. That's the only thing we know so far. And that we need to find a note for the old man. Or some John guy. And we need to... I feel like the note is what we need to find. Maybe I'm looking, not looking, meant to, well, in a minute, let me give it words out. Maybe I'm not supposed to be looking for the orb yet. Maybe we need to find the note in order to find the orb, if that makes sense. Maybe that's what we need to do. Can we chuck this in here? So confused right now. It's <sighs> gotta be something we can do, surely. I feel like we just keep running around in circles. Trying to figure out where this note and these all pieces are. But at the same time, I need something to open this door down in this room, because the thing is, it's got a lock on it, and it looks like a room that we could possibly be able to access, but it's got a lock on the door. So there must be something we can use to break the lock, or damage the lock or something, or or a key to open the door, you know what I mean? There's got to be something lurking around somewhere that we can use. It annoys me that there isn't. Mm. 
Come on. There's gotta be something. Passage or anything, or anything? I, I just don't know what to do, guys. I don't know what to do. I'm literally completely out of ideas. Because I'm guessing there's no... I'm guessing there's no, like, secret doors or anything we can go through in this area. Uh, so I keep thinking maybe behind a bootcase there'll be, like, a secret room or something. With the notes or something like that, or... Something, you know what I mean? But... I just... I just don't know. <laughs> but I'm not going to give up though. I'm generally not going to give up. Not until we figure out exactly what we need to do. So if I have to sit here for hours trying to figure this out, I will do it. You know what I mean? I feel like there's something in this room because of this podium. Hang on. Ah, we can get behind here. Okay. Okay, so there's nothing here. But at least we can get behind the desk. If for whatever reason we need to for the summit. I just don't get why there's a table there with blood on it. Like. Do you need to sacrifice somebody or something, or or someone like that? I I just don't know. Um. back in here to see if we can find something guys I'm just trying to think I do apologize if I do go quiet and stuff I'm just trying to figure out like what to do because my head is blown right now I just can't get my head around it I'm just trying to think there's got to be something at least that we can do What the hell's that? Oh! Okay. We might be onto something here, boys. We might be. Right, I need some boxes or something to stand on. Right, got these wooden crates. My pupil, Johan, said he found a way to take me with him beyond the stars. But. I was too afraid to come along. And now, all I can do is regret it. I've always hoped fire would return. Give me a second chance. But so does Alexander. That's why he keeps me here as a hostage. Right. We'll be 
Is that all we needed to do? You should hurry, Daniel. No time for sitting around. I'm not trying to sit around. I'm trying to figure out what the hell I need to do. Okay, so they've been sorted now. Can we open up these doors now or something? Hang on. No, you can't open them from here. You should hurry, so Daniel. No time for sitting around. I'm not sitting around, old man. I'm trying to figure out what the hell I need to do. Uh... You're a good boy, Daniel. Shut up. I appreciate you coming. But I believe you have more important things to take care of. Can we break it or something? Is that what we need to do? We need to climb all the way up and get up, up there completely. You should hurry, no, time for sitting around. no one's sitting around, old man. You're a good boy, and I appreciate your company. But I believe you have more important things to take care of. I certainly have, old man. I'm just trying to figure out what them things are right now. There's gotta be something we can do, surely. Uh, at least we know it's done something, okay? It's done something. I'm just trying to figure out now what to do. Like, I, I, I just don't know, guys. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm completely out of, like, ideas in general. So I just don't know what to do. But all that time, though, we had, like, a, like a little room in the, in the ceiling that we needed to, like, look at. I don't know what it's done. All I know is it's activated a third gear for something. So I'm hoping it's done something in the, one of these rooms. If not, then I haven't got a clue. Okay? Break the lock or something? No? Okay. It was worth a try though. <laughs> okay. There's no little hidden hatches in the ceiling in this room. Yeah. Let's try and get myself comfy as well, guys. I hate it when, like, you can't get comfy. <sighs> Doesn't help as well that I've been sitting on my butt for, like, nearly over an hour now. Just trying to figure out what the hell I need to do. What's 
sec. Plug in this control wire. Damn it, I just dropped some money. <laughs> My bad. There we go. Controller wire now plugged in, which is good. So also trying to mess with the wire. See, it's just actually not some cash off the side. It's only a couple of quid though, but let's pick it up after we finish recording this. I'm not gonna do any arm or anything. Right. I'm just trying to think. Uh, let's get back this way. And if I go back to the area where the old man is, I'm going to go back to the beginning area. I'm going to see if there's anything there. Because me activating that other cog, is like that other gear thing, must have done something. You know what I mean? It must have done something. So, I'm assuming it's done something for maybe something in them rooms or something where the old man is. That's the only thing I can think of. If not, then I haven't got a clue. All I do know is them doors, them heavy doors, there's got to be a way of opening them. So we need to figure out what that solution is. I ain't giving up. I'm not sitting around, old man. I'm trying to figure out what the hell I need to do. And I ain't quitting till I do, okay? Right. Let's double check in these areas, just in case, because you never know. Okay, so that door won't open. What about this room? Ah, okay. I found some levers. Oh. All this freaking time. And there were levers in these rooms. Are you taking the pee right now? I can't stop sweating and shaking. The warding ritual was not something of a sane mind. I did not even realize the dungeon was still in use. Alexander had his servants bring one of the prisoners, a murderer, he told me. Alexander made all the arrangements, but he said I had to perform the ritual in order to have the right effect. The shadow could be led astray by the blood of another. Killing the man would provide us precious time. What else could I do? Alexander said it had to be done. He is saving my life. I don't have the luxury of argument. Okay, so we gotta kill somebody? Right. Now we must be making some progress. Okay, that door went open. Let's double check in here just in case. Okay, there's definitely nothing there. Right. Let's head back down here to where that old man is. Them levers must have done something. Daniel, you have gone too far. I have to stop you. Well, tough luck, okay? Because I'm going to be proceeding further. I want to figure out what I need to do. So yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed the video so far, guys. If you are, give this video a big fat thumbs up and subscribe. Got the doors open? Oh, we got them open! Nice! Now we're definitely onto something, boys. Right. I'm going to check in this room first. And then we can go check in the other room afterwards. Okay, so we can put down some rope here. Okay, I'm guessing we can't climb down that. That does not sound healthy. 
Um, hang on, can we tie something to it? No. Let's uh, leave the rope down there, just in case we need that for a later stage or something. And we can go and see what's inside this area. But I'm so glad now we're making progress with this, because it was so annoying me nearly for an hour now. We've been lurking around, and all this time it was some levers near the beginning area, and a freaking room, that like a hidden room in the ceiling. If I knew all this sooner, we would have been this far already, but... This game is... It's tricky when it comes to the puzzles, but fun. Right, I'm just gonna... Whack up the volume a little bit more, one sec. So it's a little bit more loud in my headset so I can hear things. Okay, okay, okay. That looks... oh man. That looks horrible. What's this? Oh, we got a piece of the orb! Nice. Rape is hanged upside down. His tears spoiled with blood. Oh no. Man. That image is just. Oh. That's just nasty. Look at it. Straight from. No. Straight from the manhood upwards. This is the no no. Just the just the thought of that is just ugh, it's just cringy. <laughs> Mad. Right, see where this leads to. Okay, where does this lead to? Okay. Uh Tender box here. A knife. Oh, nasty. Ugh. Right, let's turn this. Another piece of the orb now. That's two pieces so far. We need four more. My guy's having a, having a bit of a hard time at the moment. I kind of need to make sure I keep my like sanity level up. It's making my eyes go a bit blurry. It's horrible. Uh, right, I think we're done in this room right now. I think we are done. Unless, of course, we can do something else. Do we clip? No, we, we don't clip these together. <laughs> or do we? Right, let's leave this area. And go to the next one. It literally looks like my guy's drunk or something. Ew. Dirty little bugs on the screen. Right, got a tinderbox. Use the meat. I thought I could eat the meat or something to make my vision a little bit more better, but obviously we can't. There's some oil there, which is good. 
with some string for whatever reason. And I've got a note. I will see if you do want to read these notes, guys. Um, like I have mentioned before, just pause the video at any point and you can read for these notes. As for me, I probably will read them off camera and everything when I'm editing this video. It's gotta be something. Any more cool stuff we can use to help me on my journey? What the hell's this? I feel like I'm playing something from Laser Fear or something. And with, all the, with like the portraits and stuff on the wall, it's just, uh, it's mad. Oh, look at this portrait. Looks like something from Laser Fear. Pretty insane. figure out where we have and haven't been. I don't think we've been in here. I'm not too sure. Okay, that takes me back to the nave. So I think we've got all the parts that we need from that area. I think we have. If not, we can always come back. But yeah, hopefully you're all enjoying the video, guys. If you are, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I would really, really appreciate it. We're making some progress. Despite the fact I'm feeling a little bit tired today. We are making some progress. I'm going to go back in and just double check, okay? Just to be on the safe side. Because I don't want to be leaving out any objects in case I need them. You know what I mean? There could potentially be some more ore pieces in this area. So I don't want to be messing out on them, okay? So I'm going to go for this door over here and see if there's anything in here. Oh my days. The cradle is ready. Good. You, you're a man. How did you partake in this? Is he all right? He is one of the wicked. Don't pay his lies any attention. I'm not a bad man. It was an accident. He set a man on fire. It wasn't my fault. Why won't anyone listen? That's horrible. Of course. We are dealing with monsters here. This is insane. Or not, I don't think I can help you, unfortunately. Setting a man on fire is one thing, but man, Ooh. these torture chambers are just uh, very disturbing. Hang on. Ah, there we are, my friends. Found another piece of the orb. So I think that's all the PCs in this particular area. I'm, I'm quite sure it is. But if there is more, we can always come back. I think we've got three PCs now, if I remember correctly. Three. So we need to make off to another area. Itchy ear, my friends. Got this like itch, like a little bit of a rash. Or a cut on the inside of my ear so every time I put my finger in my ear it's it's rubbing and hurting but it really irritates me so I feel like I need to scratch if that makes sense but obviously having headsets on for, like for a lot of the time as well it really does irritate my ears as well so that's why sometimes I do have to take little breaks here and there where in between like obviously recording videos and stuff and that's why when I'm at work I don't need to wear headsets which is always a good thing But 
but 99.9% .9 of the time when I'm at home. I'm normally making videos, so I've always tend to get my headset on. There's been times as well where, you probably laugh at this guys, where I've gone to bed and forgot to take my headset off. And I've woken up and thinking, what? Like, I'm trying to itch my ears or sort my hair out. I'm like, oh, still got my headset on. No, I mean, I've done that before because you get so used to it being on your head, so you just don't feel it there sometimes, if that makes sense. But it's only on rare occasions I've done that. Okay. All right, got some more tinder boxes. We need to obviously, uh... ooh, that's what we need. Definitely need that. I need to obviously as well check these uh, drawers and stuff. Just in case. Because you never know what could be in these drawers. I go another tinder box. Definitely gonna need that. Nothing in there. I'm thinking of obviously uh, probably playing for about two hours today on this. I'm thinking of recording for about two hours because I've still got a couple more hours before I need to go work. And a seat is. I'm thinking of probably playing for around about two hours. Maybe more, depending on how much we can get done. Unless, of course, we can make really big progress and then I will bring it to an end. But if it says that, you know, it takes some time to get to a few further stages in the game then I'll make this an even longer part okay I'm not sure how many more parts there is going to be on this game because I'm not sure how long in general this game is but for people out there if you have completed this game before um, let me know I'm close to the end of the game or have I still got a long way to go yet just let me know so then I uh, know roughly how many parts there probably will be Roughly. 15th of August, 1839. The blood wards are failing. The shadow beckons, and its cry disarms my actions. Hurry. No time to spare. You have to kill another. Alexander produces a knife. He wants me to cut the flesh. Do it. Save yourself. He is a murderer, Daniel. He is evil. A cold-blooded killer. Hurry! Alexander, you must let me be. I have to concentrate. Take the man, cut the lines, cut the flesh, watch the blood spill, let it come. Please, I didn't do anything. Take the man, cut the lines, take the man, cut the lines. Leave the man from this. Oh my days. I did well. One life for another. You hear me, guardian of the orb? I did all this for you. Now, once more, withdraw your shadow from my domain. Wow, okay. Alexander, there isn't much time. I can feel it. We must act swiftly. I will do whatever it takes. This is insane. I'm guessing we gotta go down here. We're playing for an hour and 20 minutes now, boys. Man, this game is getting a lot more intense. It's getting a lot more deeper into the story. But I'm really enjoying it. I'm finding it a lot of fun. I'm interested to see how the ending is going to be for this game. And see what other cool stuff we can uncover when it comes to the storyline perspective. Man. 
What are my intentions, Daniel? Salvation. It used to be yours, but now you only seek misplaced revenge. How do you justify your violence? Is it for the greater good? Are you doing the world a service? It is you who caused all this pain and death. If you had accepted your fate and submitted to the orb when you first discovered it, none of this would have happened. It is curiosity in league with your selfishness that is killing us. Wow. Do we need to go inside that? They want to, just in case he closes on me and kills me. Man, that was mad. Got an ore piece here, another piece. Making big plays right now, boys. I think there's only a few more pieces we need. I think it's about two or three pieces now. That all that's all we need. And then we've done it. Need to try and figure out where these pieces are though. I'm assuming there will be in this area somewhere. I'm assuming. I could be wrong, but it's worth a uh, scout around the area and see what we can find. My god, this game is so intense. It's helped a lot more now that since I've um, cranked the volume up on my headset because the fact is I can. Listen out for a lot more things in the environment, and I can tell there's some monster thing lurking around somewhere. That creature is nearby. Which isn't a good sign. So I'm assuming if there is um, all PCs lurking around, he's gonna try his best to stop me, any. This is weird. Okay, I got a. When it lets me pick it up, a tinder box, so we can uh, light the fire. Let there be light, my friend. So we can't open it. Okay, so there's, there's nothing in here, unfortunately. That's what it seems like, anyway. So we can't open up the flat, up that um, inside of the bull or anything. So I'm assuming that's just. A dead end. Just have to progress to other areas and see if we can find anything else. I'm not sure how many pieces I need. I've kind of lost count. I think it's two or three. I'm assuming it's two. I'm assuming, but I don't know. Oh my days. No. No, bro. Leave me alone. I've got that weird guy chasing me. Did I actually lose him, man? I think I did. She dead? I think we must have got away from him. 
If so, that's just brilliant. Like, it means I can outrun him. Which I didn't realize you could do that. Alright. Let's keep moving now. The wheel is good for keeping your victim still during the procedure. They can be bound around the circumference or simply stretched across, tying limbs to the spokes and rim. All tools are by this point useful, and you may administer the torture in any way you like. But the forte of the wheel is the gaps. When you have decided that the victim shall die, you can smash their limbs with a hammer, making them fold in between the frame. But they'll die. Too quickly, I mean. No, don't worry. The human body is much more resilient. They can survive for days until they finally succumb. That's just disgusting. Is that even doing anything? few pieces of this orb now. We've got four pieces in total, so we definitely need two more pieces. I'm assuming it's four pieces, unless I've got five. Huh? I've got five pieces of the orb, so I need one more piece. Uh... Proper confused right now, guys. I'm trying to figure what the hell I need to do. So I need to try and find that last piece of the orb, which I am going to clear where they are, where it is. For all I do know is I'm one piece off. Then we need to find this note for the old man. Oh my days. Not good, not good, not good. Uh, run! I need to get moving. Go, 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 go. There's got to be one more piece somewhere. Where I do not know, but there's got to be something. Somewhere. Oh, my days. This game is proper, proper intense, like it's... I don't know what to say. I just hope that we can manage to find this piece because we really do need it. Is there anything? Anywhere? gotta be something. <laughs> Maybe the final piece is in that room where the, um, that was locked up. It could be in there. This could be a good chance. That's what my thoughts are. It could be there. If not, it's gonna be down here somewhere. See if it's in here. Have we just been in here? 
Yeah, we have. This is the one with the wheel. Like rope and everything in this area. Chains. Spinning the wheel isn't, doesn't seem like he's doing anything. Tinderbox, some oil. Oh, my days. The monster's here. Right, let's go back out here to see if we can uh, try and find the last orb that we need. We've got five out of six orbs right now. So there's one more somewhere that we still need to get his hands on. I'm going to play for an hour and a half now, guys. Just hoping that you're enjoying the video so far. If you are, give this video a big fat thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more of Amnesia here on the channel. Obviously, once we beat this game, if you want me to play the other games out of the Amnesia series, then I will play them. Uh, Cetus, I have got all the Amnesia games, so if you want me to play them, I will. And hopefully they're not going to be trickier than this one, because this one's got some really tricky puzzles in it, which I'm kind of, I've been kind of struggling with them, but we're still managing to do them. You know what I mean? The game's tricky, but not too tricky. Ah, you again. Incredible. You found Vaya's recipe. That there might still be a chance. Listen carefully. Alexander is working on opening a gate, a door to another world. It's where he wants to go. If you could put your anger aside, let him open the portal before you take your revenge. Let me pass the gate, Daniel. Please, find the ingredients and pass upon it via this climb. And do so before you assemble the orb. The barrier keeping you from the inner sanctum will only be breached for a short time. Unless everything is taken care of before mending the all, you won't be able to save it. Alright. We'll see what I can do, old man, okay? We found the guy's recipe, which is always a good sign. So we've, we've made some progress. We must have found the note. We just need to find the orb now, the final orb. I'm just hoping that we can do this though, because honestly, it's it's getting trickier and trickier. <laughs> All right, can we go in here? No, still one bunch. Right. Let's go and nosy around in these areas just in case. In case there's anything. Things could have changed. I do not know. Okay. Can we put anything on here? No? Orbs? No? Okay, so you can't put the orbs on there. So most definitely need to go on that pedestal by the other room. But just want to double check, just in case there is like a, another meaning for him before I take him over to that area. You know what I mean, I just want to be on the safe side right now. I've got a jar as well. This jar, I'm not sure what I need for it. I feel I feel like I need it for something. All 
Right. Just need to go place these um, orbs down on the pedestal. I know I still need one more, but at least then they're all here. For now. Alright, so I need to put that one there. And there. And there. And there. And that one there. Just need one more now. One more. Ah. Okay. Just one more orb. That's all I need. It's got to be lurking around somewhere. But I'm just glad that we're making this um, progress so far because I did think at first we're going to be stuck just running around in circles trying to figure out everything. But just knowing that we've managed to suss out the first bits always leads to finding out where the next bits are. You know what I mean? I never thought in my mind that it would evolve having to uh, go back on myself to lower some levers and obviously mess with a little hatch in the ceiling and stuff like that. It's... It's mind-blowing because I just didn't think these things would be a thing that we'd need to do, but that's one thing I do like with this game. It's got a lot of puzzles, very surprising puzzles, but I'm enjoying it, guys. I really am enjoying it. It's tricky, but I'm enjoying it. And I'm just hoping that you're enjoying these long like, parts as well, long playthrough parts, when it comes to uh, my Let's Plays here on the channel, because the thing is... Takes up a lot of my time, but I'm just hoping that you enjoy it because at the end of the day, I like giving you guys longer videos. You know, I mean, I can get more done in longer videos, so I'm just hoping that you're enjoying them. If you are, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. I'd really, really appreciate it. And if you do have any game suggestions, drop them in the comment section. Uh, maybe I could try out the game that you suggest at some point in the near future as a Let's Play. And I will give you guys a shout out for it as well. If you do have any suggestions. I'm going to try and go back down in that area. Where that freaking monster thing is. To see if we can try and find another pot down there. If I can't then I'm going to look elsewhere around the area. To see if we can find it. So I feel like maybe it's going to be down here somewhere. Uh Okay. The remaining orb pieces can be found in Okay, so the parts are in here. Okay. It's gonna double check in case they're in this room. You just never know. I don't trust like rooms I've been in before because the thing is, knowing that I've had to go back on myself just to press some levers before makes me doubt like every single room I've ever been in. It makes me think, you know, man, have I missed something? Is there something else I need to get from another room? So I just want to double check everywhere to see if I can find these things. Operation Aaron Cooper find the last orb is a go. Come on. It's got to be around here somewhere. Just going to double check the rooms. Every room that I've been in, I need to double check them. Just to be on the safe side. I'm just thinking, can we actually go inside this thing? Probably can't, but it'd be pretty cool. Like if it like opens up a gateway or something. Let's double check it. Let's try it. I'm 
hiding. Oh. Okay, I'm not gonna do that again. I just thought maybe that you could do something. You never know. Right. If I was a little orb somewhere, where would I be? In a horrible freaking place like this. Because this place is an absolute freaking nightmare, you know what I mean? You got some douchebag running around trying to kill me. And. <laughs> Man, I just. I just need to try and find this orb and get the hell out of here. Gotta be around here somewhere. Right, it's in this area where the wheel was. I know we're going all from in here, but it could be a chance it could be another one. Tie a rope to that. Uh... Um, I don't know, guys. I really don't know. This rope. No. Okay. Maybe you can't use the rope down here. It was worth a try, though. You never know. I'm just trying to think. The only room that I can think of that I didn't get anything else of was that room where the uh, ball was, but. I scouted that area and I'm I'm sure I didn't see nothing in there. Oh my days. Come on bro, Lee, give me a break. No! Run, 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 run! That's the thing, it's hard to outrun them things. They are pretty quick. Right. I'm just trying to think. I, I just don't know, guys. It's got to be down here somewhere, surely. This is the room with the ball. Is it in here? Is it anywhere in here? Okay, so you can't open that. <gasps> it's there! It was right in front of me the whole time. Are you... Are you freaking kidding me? We got all the parts, though, for the orb now. Man, that was just... <sighs> I'm an idiot. I must have like scouted past that millions of times and not even realized it was there. I'm a freaking idiot, literally. 
wasted so much time running around trying to find out where that thing is and <laughs> all that time it was sitting on the floor in plain view, you know what I mean? Fair play though, fair play. At least we got them all now. So now we're going to assemble the orbs and see what happens next, guys. Hopefully, it's going to get me the hell out of here. Because the old man was talking about I need to assemble the orbs. Also, I need to do some ingredient for something so then I can free that old man. I don't know if this old man's going to be like a good guy or a bad guy. I'm hoping he stays a good guy and helps me out. But, time will tell. So I could deal with a but uh, like with a buddy on my team, you know what I mean? I need someone helping me out. Come on. That does not sound good. All the old pieces now. Gonna stick them on that podium. Let's get the hell out of here. Hopefully, hopefully, it does something that's gonna help me get out of here. He talks about a portal from another world, so maybe I need. Maybe it's gonna open up or something. I don't know now. But hopefully, it does something. Right. No! Are you freaking kidding me? Why was the two of them? Man, that was insane. Literally, they were just waiting there for me. You know what I mean? Just like, bang! See in a bit, Aaron. There was no way I was getting away from them. But still. Oh, okay. It was supposed to happen. What the hell? Am I in some jail or something? I'm in. Some, I'm in jail. <laughs> you had me worried. Quite frankly, I'm not sure what to do with you. Are you kidding me? You, Daniel. We are so very much the same, you and I. Did you really drink from the amnesia mixture? It does explain so much of your behavior. You never did finish what you set out to do. You talked about redemption, how you would face the orb's shadow and save our work and me. I will grant you another chance to redeem yourself. You can wait here and stop the shadow. Thank you, friend. Are you kidding me right now? How the hell do I get out of this cell? What the hell do I need to do? I'm confused. Do I need to break the bars or something? Come on. There's gotta be some way out of here. Hang on. Got an idea, but I don't think it's going to work. It could work. As long as I don't drop the bed. Hang on. Ah, oh, okay. Nice. So you snap the bar. Ah, okay. I get it. I get it. So what I need to do is I need to put the bar up. 
Right, got the iron bar. I need to... Okay, that doesn't work. Um, I need to move the bed, don't I? I'm thinking if I pull the bed too, I can probably climb on it and try and crouch my way through the bars. That might be the best suggestion. Unless there's an alternative way. It's not loose enough. Wow. <laughs> I fling that straight across the room. It's not going to snap, is it? Ah, damn it. Okay. Okay. Definitely can't do it that way. What the hell? What am I supposed to do with that? I'm stuck in prison, boys. What the hell do I need to do? days. There's got to be something I can do right now. Do I need to climb on the bed and shimmy out by crouching out or can I break my way out or can I... There's got to be something I can do. I'm assuming I need to like pull the bed out but it's not letting me pull it out so I need to think of a plan B just in case I can't use the bed. I don't know. I've got to be able to use the bed surely or something. No! So if I could break the bars, I'd break that and then squeeze through the gap, but I just can't. I'll do nothing with that. Oh, damn it. Um. Alright, you can't do nothing with that bar. We've got to be able to pull the bed, surely. If we can't pull the bed out, I've got no clue what to do. It's got to be something. Come on. Bed, don't let me down, please. Oh. It's moving, it's moving. It was moving. Oh, 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 oh. Big plays right now, boys. Big plays. Right, come on. There we go. Right. Jump on the bed. Crouch. And we're out of prison, boys. And look at that now. The smash the wall through as I've climbed out. Couldn't you do that while I was in there? Would have been a lot more easier, but... I guess we can't always have what we want these days, unfortunately. Alright, let's wind this thing up. doesn't do anything. Right. I need to look around and see what I can find. Hmm. 
There's got to be something I can use. Alright, is anything inside this cell? Got a note here. Yo, this guy's naked and he's dead. And I can see his ding dong. That's just not good. Poor guy. <laughs> he died and he's naked. The world has just seen his ding dong. That must be embarrassing for him. You need to, you need to like cover yourself up, okay? Because I don't want like YouTube thinking I'm showing nudity in my videos. You know what I mean? It's the last thing I want. Right. Um, can we? Ooh, uh, can we? A bottle here. Can we go in here. No, we can't go in there. It's locked. Damn it! Hang on. I'm assuming I can put the buckets on here, right? I'm assuming. Can we put the buckets on here? No? Try the bucket. Yes, we can. Nice. Right. Okay, so we can't put items inside it, which kind of sucks. I guess we need to wheel it all the way back down again. Come on, going down. Wheel it all the way back up. Come on. I've got a bucket of water. I'm not sure what I need the, the water for, but I need it for something. These bugs need to get off my screen. That's terrible. Yeah. Really, really disgusting. Right. Okay, we can't combine nothing with a bucket of water. So why do we need a bucket of water? Hang on. There's got to be something we can need it for. Surely. Yo, dead man. You okay? Uh... Can you, like, move, please? Okay. I'm just trying to think. What do we need the water for? What could we possibly need water for in here? Ugh. Ugh, I'm so tired. Why am I tired? Just been playing for just about two hours now, guys. Just over two hours. So hopefully you're all enjoying the video. If you are, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I would really, really appreciate it. It's going to be a proper long episode. I'm not sure how much more I'm going to be playing on this episode. Or whether or not I will be bringing it to an end or not yet. But I just want to find a way out of here first. At least before I decide on whether I want to continue or not. What about the pipes, huh? Good, good shape. Uh... 
Is there anything I can do? Ow. Spang my toe. Oh, okay, I get it, I get it. So I need to try and nudge the key out the pipe, I'm guessing. In order to do that, can't be reached. I will put a. Well, no, can't put a rope on it. Uh, water? Hold well, on. No, can we sm no, I can't smash it open. The other thing I could think of is the water. But... Wouldn't that just be a waste of water? Hmm, let's try it. Uh, let's try the water. Right, there we go. I get it. So, if the water brushes the key out. And now we've got a rusty key. And I'm assuming the key... Is gonna be for this door. There we go. Big progression, boys. Eventually got there in the end. My days. I'm moving, boys. I'm moving. to run. Sounds like I've got some monster chasing me. Or I've got something behind me that's causing a massive racket. That was insane, you know what I mean? There's something making a huge racket, it sounds like even a monster, or it was Summit. But I don't want to stick around to find out what that was. Right. Um, is there anything in here that I can use? Any tinder boxes or hell for anything? Right, got a tinder box, got a note. Is our character okay? Eighteenth of August, eighteen thirty-nine. Tonight, we will unlock the power of the orb and ultimately banish the shadow hunting me. I feel it closing in on me, and I fear for my life more than ever. Just outside Holstein lies a small settlement where Zimmerman, a dairy farmer, lives with his wife and his new children. How the hell did we get a farm? Our visit was unexpected, and Alexander was able to strike the Zimmerman down without alerting his office. went to take care of the farmhands, I began to look for the children. We should have more than enough prisoners to finish the ritual now. This is insane. Mm. 
So yeah, hopefully you're all enjoying it, guys. Been playing for two minutes, two hours, not two minutes, two hours and five minutes now. Um, but the seat is, I'm going to do a little bit more, then I will bring this video to an end then. Just want to see what happens next. I want to finish this orb off and everything. It's just insane. <laughs> In a proper numb butt as well, just for sitting in this chair for so long. Man. Alright. Back in action, baby. Right, let's wind this bad boy up. The other way, Aaron. Why aren't he doing it? Really? It's just not winding up properly. Hey, why? This is weird, guys. Where? Let's try it this way. Let's get the other way. Come on. Okay, there's nothing on the end of the bucket. Oh, not the bucket, on the end of the rope. Right. Sound good. Oh! I know where I am. I'm back at the beginning area. That's what that's what it looks like anyway. Yeah, it looks like the beginning area. But I just want to know is that old man still okay? to him. Hopefully he's okay. The last thing I want is the old man dying or something. But so far he's been quite useful. It's been helpful. And obviously he does want to help me on my my journey with this. So I kind of need to make my own alliance right now. So I could be doing with his help. Yeah, old man. Dad, I thought I'd lost you. The castle troubled and I could hear the chancel collapse. The laboratory might be accessible now. Okay. I'm guessing you mean by laboratory, uh, that room that I couldn't get into before. If you mean that room, if not that room, then I haven't got a clue. Well, the one thing I do know that I can do now is I can assemble the orb and put it on that pedestal. That's one thing I definitely can do now. We've got to be close to the end of the game now, surely. Or three quarters of the way through it, at least. Because we've made so much progression since the previous parts and everything, and... There's no creepy... well, there's no two creepy monsters leaking on. There's one on the left. The right side's been... destroyed. This way, though. This is the one that leads to the um, portal thing. So, what I'm going to do is going to put this part of the orb down. There we go. 
The orb has been formed, my friends. Okay. But what do I do? Okay, I need to let the orb carry on doing that. It might need more power or something. Um, gotta die. Alright, see what's down here. Ah, the door's open now. So we can finally access this room then, which is good. This place is an absolute mess. Nah. We need to stop them. Is that what we need to do? Okay, we need to do something with these, um... Ooh, hang on, hang on. We need to do something with them, um, gears. Can we block them or something, or break them? I'm just trying to think. something we can do. See you and everything. I'm assuming I need to break the gears because it's saying I can interact with them, but I can't do nothing with them, so. be a purpose for coming in this room. I'm assuming it is to destroy them gears. That's what my theory is. If not, then I have not got a clue. It's not large enough to jam the cog wheels. Right. I know what I need to do now. We need something large to jam him. Right. I need something big. Big and heavy. Let's try... Oh, you can't pick up the gears. Ah, uh, damn it. The hammer doesn't seem like it... Mind you. Would the hammer work? It might work. Large enough. Uh, okay, we need a big item. Something big. Right, let's 
try this rock. If this rock doesn't work, I have not got a clue. Please work, come on. That did work, but I don't know what it's done. It's done something that caused a massive explosion. Oh my days. Right, I need to hide. Go behind here, boys. Please don't see me. I'm not here, bro, okay? Let's go away. Is he gone or is he still there? I think he might have gone. For now. <laughs> I mean, this thing, this guy always seems to come back somewhere or another. I'm going to try and look at that um, portal where the um, oil pedestal is. I'm going to see if there's any changes that's happened there. If not, I'm going to head back to the to the old man. Whew, come on. Making some big progress right now, Aaron. All my days. I need to wait for that guy to go through. So he's out of my line of sight. So then I, if I do go in that direction, which I'm going to, I hopefully he would have disappeared. Alright. Moment of truth to find out whether or not that thing's going to come running at me or not. Fingers crossed it doesn't. Sanctum. Right. I don't know what sort of things we're going to be expecting to see down here, boys, but all I do know is it's probably going to be mad stuff. Okay. Can we put something on here? Guess we need to put an item on there. Or something. Here. 1839. It's not fair. I'm not to blame. I've been manipulated by that demon. He played my guilty conscience and duped me into facing the shadow alone. That vile, conspiring man. He expects me to meet my death as he steals power beyond imagination. Alex, now. So here we are, my friends, carrying on right now. I see to just had a bit of a pause with my Elgato game capture software. I decided to have a little moment, so I had to cut the recording and then reboot the Elgato up again. So I do apologize if anything slightly unsyncs itself. Um, it's just because my Elgato has been having a few problems recently. I don't know why. Might need to invest in another one. Oh my days. 
this is pickling my brain right now. I don't know what the hell I need to do. I'm assuming I need to press these altars or I need to put something on these altars. He's telling me to interact with them, but I can't do nothing with them. That's why I don't care. Hang on. One note speaks of mixtures made with three ingredients. Hang on. Notes. Diaries. Hang on. That's insane. Okay, have we got to do that with the other one? Is that what we need to do? You do sacrifice your soul or something to this thing? I think that's what we need to do. <laughs> ah, okay. Oh, man. I think that's what we need to do, boys. Not 100% sure, but I think I'm doing it right. Okay, it's not doing it. Right. I'll figure this out on the next part guys, but what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring this video to an end. If you've enjoyed the playthrough and you've enjoyed this part so far, all I'd ask guys is if you give this video a big fat thumbs up and subscribe. We've been playing for over two hours now, uh, nearly two and a half hours, nearly. Uh, but the seat is... It's been a lot of fun and I'm hoping that you will enjoy it. We made a lot of progression and I'm hoping that part 5 is going to be a lot more fun. That we're going to be able to engage into even more of the story. If not complete the game, I do not know how close we are to the end of it. If you guys know if I'm close to beating the game, let me know down below in the comment section. Thank you for watching. You've been awesome and I'll see you again real soon. Take care.